Democrats walked out during a vote on a critical race theory bill. The bill passed just a day after it made out of committee. The state superintendent of education says the subject matter is not being taught in K-12 through schools. 12 News' Tal Ta has the story and the moments leading up to the vote. Will you agree with me that it's not necessary? No, sir, I believe it is necessary. In a vote of 32 to 2, a bill banning critical race theory from being taught in Mississippi schools is moving on to the House. But not before heads turned on the Senate floor Friday morning. And just moments before the bill passed, a walkout among Democratic senators who made it loud and clear they were having no part in a bill banning critical race theory. Senator Michael McLendon, who authored Senate Bill 2113, insists he has no intentions of changing history. When asked repeatedly, Can you define what a critical race theory is? And what is the purpose of this bill as it regards race and instruction? The same answer was given. That no child is superior or inferior to another. The majority of lawmakers who voted for the critical race theory bill included State Senator Jeremy England. I know we've had our faults and we need to keep talking about them. We absolutely do. But with Mississippi seemingly making strides since changing the state flag. We have the cohesiveness and uh, hope, had hoped that the state had progressed enough that we can move on in one accord. And as Black History Month approaches in February. This was a sad day in the state of Mississippi. Some wonder if this will cause the Magnolia State to backtrack in a subject matter typically taught in higher education that examines how racism has shaped society. If we're going to change the direction of our state, we're going to have to go to the poll. Reporting in Jackson, Tao Ta, 12 News.